George Takei says he's shocked and bewildered by sexual assault claim from 80s. Star Trek actor George Takei is denying allegations that he sexually assaulted a former model and actor in his Los Angeles home back in the 1980s. Scott R. Brunton told The Hollywood Reporter that when he was 23, he met Takei, who was in his 40s at the time, at a local bar. One night in 1981, Brunton claimed, after the two men went out, Takei invited Brunton back to his Los Angeles condo for a nightcap. We have the drink, and he asks, if I would like another, Brunton said in the magazine. And I said sure. So, I have the second one, and then all of a sudden, I begin feeling very disoriented and dizzy, and I thought I was going to pass out. I said I need to sit down, and he said, sit over here, and he had the giant, yellow beanbag chair, Brunton said. So I sat down in that, and leaned my head back, and I must have passed out. Brunton then claims the actor groped him inappropriately. I came to him and said, what are you doing? I said, I don't want to do this. He goes, you need to relax. I am just trying to make you comfortable. Get comfortable. And I said, no. I don't want to do this. And I pushed him off, and he said, okay, fine, the former model and actor said. And I said, I am going to go, and he said, if you feel you must. You're in no condition to drive. I said, I don't care I want to go. ABC News reached out to Brunton, but didn't immediately hear back. ABC News also reached out to reps for Takei, but didn't immediately hear back. Takei, now 80, who is best known for his role as Hikaru Sulu on the original Star Trek television series, took to Twitter to deny the allegations. I want to assure you all that I am as shocked and bewildered at these claims as you must feel reading them, he wrote Saturday morning. The events he describes back in the 1980s simply did not occur, and I do not know why he has claimed them now. I have racked my brain to ask if I remember Mr. Brunton, and I cannot say I do. The events he describes back in the 1980s simply did not occur, and I do not know why he has claimed them now. I have racked my brain to ask if I remember Mr. Brunton, and I cannot say I do. Two Takei said he's taking Brunton's claims seriously, which is why he wanted to respond. Right now it is a he said he said situation, Dover alleged events nearly 40 years ago, Takei wrote. But those that know me understand that non-consensual acts are so antithetical to my values and my practices, the very idea that someone would accuse me of this is quite personally painful. Right now it is a he said he said situation, Dover alleged events nearly 40 years ago. But those that know me understand that non-consensual acts are so antithetical to my values and my practices, the very idea that someone would accuse me of this is quite personally painful. For the actor also wrote on Twitter that his husband, Brad, is 100% beside me on this. As my life partner of more than 30 years and now my husband stands fully by my side. I cannot tell you how vital it has been to have his unwavering support and love in these difficult times. Takei ended a series of tweets by addressing his fans. Thanks to many of you for all the kind words and trust. It means so much to us, he said. Thanks to many of you for all the kind words and trust. It means so much to us. Yours in gratitude, George and